Autism employment specialists work with their clients to help develop skills they may be lacking to successfully land a job. Most of them have social deficits or communication challenges. One of my clients would actually, if you asked them a question, just freeze and sit there and stare at you. Not going to get them a job. It's very challenging. So when you look at those traditional routes, it's not successful for employment. Because of the structure of the current model, they only get one hour a month to support somebody who is finding and getting ready to get employment and maintain employment. If you're neurotypical, an hour a month is incredibly low. Never mind somebody who could be new to the job force, new to developing interview skills, like there's a lot there. And thanks to my business partner, Paulette Goddard, we were able to discover what was being used and why it was so ineffective. So we've developed NanoWorks initially to connect the autism community to autism employment specialists. Turned out that wasn't the problem. The problem was that the autism employment specialists didn't have the correct technology, not only to do their job, but to adequately maintain and, and keep the, the progress going of somebody who is autistic and looking for a job. Spiro Careers Canada is developing NanoWorks, a neurodiverse accessible network that actually works to help bridge the gap in technology. This allows them to get more done in less time and use less of the coaching time on administrative tasks than is what's currently happening. Right? If you only get an hour a month, maybe two, you just need to make the heck out of that and make sure that the individual also has access to tools that can, they can continue their progress on their own doesn't exist right now really. Their response to uh, being able to have all the, the preliminary work and, and the, the assessments and done ahead of time is amazing because then we're not wasting time sitting in the office. They know that when they come in we're going to review what they've done and move to the next step. We're not sitting there waiting for them to do the first step. We can actually jump right into it. Some of the assessment tools we use clearly outline goals for them to work on. So we have it already there. We don't have to wait to get to know you. Build that rapport and all of that other stuff that goes along with this job to get them started. We're right there where they're at and we know where they're at and we can figure out how to move them on. NanaWorks was just chosen at Mohawk College in the software development program for a third year project. Four students will be working on the app for the next four months. In addition, they also received a $130,000 grant from the Canadian Council of Rehabilitation and Work AIM Fund to help make resources more accessible. They feel better, they feel more confident, they're more likely to show up at interviews prepared, they're more likely to search for jobs that work for them versus taking whatever job is available, which is what most folks end up doing. So far we're getting a lot of positive feedback on how that solution is filling that gap that we started talking about. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Nikki Wesley.